Hello, 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 everybody! Hello! The fan is on, the windows are still open, nothing has changed since this morning's stream because it's still obnoxiously bloody hot here. Uh, it is currently 25 degrees outside. This is cold as it's been all week. It's too hot, it's too hot. But not for much longer, for today! Today! Hugs will destroy Claire. We are going to freeze this dragon gym over. We are going to create a new ice age within the gym. Let's address the two rather big fucking elephants in the room. The fact that Dumbledore and blah 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 blah, blah have somehow evolved. <laughs> Despite the fact that they are trained evolutions. Um, and also the fact that blah, 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 requires a special item, which as far as everyone watching is concerned, I didn't have. So, I have done some grinding, as you can see, off screen. Uh, everyone is now at least uh, level 40, in the mid to high 40s, or in the case of hugs, over level 50. Claire's Kingdra is level 45. Lance's Dragonite is level 50. We are prepared for everything in Johto now. <laughs> I do not... S provided nothing unforeseen happens, because you never fucking know with us, with these streams. We should be good. We shouldn't lose a single Pokemon now until we are done with Johto. The only real... Problem I will see is Will. Uh, everyone else I have a counter to. So, while grinding, I found uh, the item that you give to Electrobuzz in order to evolve it. I forget the actual name of it, but whatever the hell, whatever the hell it is, I found it while grinding. Uh, as for the evolutions. Uh, there is an option, hang on, if I jump over to my webcam, Twitch, please ignore the fact that I have the game open in a, uh, window. I'm sure you will, but please, please do. Uh, so, if I open up the randomizer, for those who haven't seen this, this is how I randomize the Pokemon ROMs. It's free. You can just go Google, download Universal Pokemon Randomizer. Uh, so, there is a option. There we go. There is change impossible evolutions. So, what this does is what it says there. Any Pokemon that where the evolution is impossible in the current game, so long as the evolved Pokemon's data is in the game, so, so, long as the, so you can't use it in Gen 1, let's say. The Pokemon has to exist within the game, obviously. Uh, you, it changes the way that Pokemon evolves. So any trade evolutions or any Pokemon that require items that said item doesn't exist in the game. Uh, so, for example, uh, Eevee. In Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver, Leafeon and Glaceon exist in this game. But there is no, you know, big mossy stone that you need to use in order to evolve them into uh, Leafeon or vice versa for Glaceon. Because for those that don't know, in Sinnoh, there are two spots. One is in the opening forest. The other is near the ice gym city. I forget the actual names of them. But you uh, basically evolve an EV around the... You basically level up an EV while next to one of those stones. 
and you get Leafeon or Glaceon. Because of the fact those don't exist in uh, Johto or Kanto, the only way to get e uh, a Leafeon or Glaceon in hard gold or soul silver is to trade one over from Diamond, Pearl or Platinum or Black or Gen 5. Because I'm not sure if you can get one in Gen 5. I don't know. I don't remember. However, this changed it so that you can evolve Eevee into Leafeon using a Leaf Stone or Glaceon using something else. I don't remember what. Most, most of Pokemon where they are evolved through trade, it just levels up. It's just on level up. So for example, Dumbledore who loves so him was a Kadabra, evolved into Al Alakazam at level 37. Um, and there's a few others, because I looked up what ones it actually affects, because I was curious. Uh, so, um, all of the ones where it's like, oh, they evolved by being traded while holding this item, like Electrobuzz, Magma, etc., you basically give them the item to hold and level them up. So, yeah. Uh, where is Pokemon? There's Pokemon. So, that's why I now have an Electrovere and a Alakazam. And also, because I did, because I got, I got bored. <laughs> <laughs> I was very bored. I've been very bored this week. Uh, I also have a Magmorta as well. Uh, most of... Yeah, both Sandy and uh, Duckface are now both level 31. Because they're backups. Right? These guys I see them making into the team at some point. Like, I can see Sandy coming in when we get to Kanto and need to take on the 10th Surge. Uh, or Boomer one of them uh, but yeah 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 so what is the plan when it comes to Claire the plan when it comes to Claire is quite simple we lead with hugs who isn't so much huggable he's not nearly as huggable anymore She's not nearly as huggable anymore, I should say. Um, we have a fair bit to use against Claire. Those her dragon airs are fucked. The king's was a bit of a concern, but that is why we have blah 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 and bitey. Both of whom are either on par or a level higher than the Kingdra. And if shit gets really bad, we can maybe bring a double door. Maybe. Um, Phil will be mostly sitting this one out. Uh, and Binet. Binet, I don't really see much of a use for. So we'll see. We will see. But anyway, anyway, I think, I think it's time. We have one more gym. We have one more gym. Let's do it. Also, uh, one thing as well before I forget, because I've just noticed it in my stream event down in the bottom corner. Uh, Ninja Layla, thank you very much for the follow in between streams. Thank you. Welcome. Hope you, if you're watching, hope you enjoy. Yo, champ in the making! The gym has an unstable foot and keep your Pokemon in their Pokeballs. Now, Claire uses the mythical and sacred dragon type Pokemon. You can't damage them very easily. But you know they're supposed to be weak against ice type moves. Hell yeah, I know that. Oh, yeah, I remember this gym now. It's just sliding block puzzles. Bring it! Your first battle against dragons. I'll show you how tough they are. Oh, fuck, I've fought dragons before. I kicked the shit out of Lance back in Kanto. Oh, no. 
Oh. Why must you torment me? Hugs, kill it. Oh yeah, I turned battle animations off. I need to put them back on. I turned them off for the sake of uh, speed <laughs> grinding. Don't worry, we'll turn those back on in a, in a moment. I've completely forgot to turn them back on before we started. That's my B. It's fine. Oh, hi, Cedra. You're not a dragon type. Moment of truth time. How does Crunch do against it? Not very well. Right, okay. Because that was my, uh, that was my, that was going to be my backup for how to take out the uh, Kingdra. Just crunch it. Just go nom nom. Right, let's, uh, let's turn on battle animations. There we go. Alright. We good. We, 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 we. We good. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine, I'll let no one tell you otherwise. Ha ha, the highest level Pokemon in here is level 45. We're fine. We are fine. Nom 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 Hey, well, that's a dead routine. Wait, is Citra a dragon type? No? It's just water type? Right? It doesn't become a sea. it doesn't become a dragon type until it's a Kingdra. If I remember correctly. I should be right about that. But I'm not 100% sure. But go away, Mum! Nobody likes you. You know, this is why Dad left. Just saying. Yes, I would like to rest my Pokemon. Let's rest. Let us rest up. Get the PP back. I'm gonna lie, I'm kind of nuts. Kind of. Kind of. Only only very slightly. Like... I'm fairly confident we've got this. Like... What's the worst thing my kingdom is gonna have? Hyper Beam, I think it... It does have Hyper Beam. Yes, it does have Hyper Beam. I know that. I know for a fact it has Hyper Beam. Puzzles. <laughs> Yay, I'm smart. A big brain that It's not as if we all use dragon type Pokemon, it's about more than that. We're interested in strong Pokemon, that's my fe uh oh. Well no, that's not fair. No. No, that's not how it works. <laughs> yeah, we don't just use dragon type Pokemon, we just use strong Pokemon. Go horsey! Yeah. Yeah, feel intimidated now? Yeah, my horsey will crush you. My horsey is the most powerful po- and it's dead. That's a bit more intimidating. It's also level 37. Ha! Huh. OK. 
Okay. So that thing's now going to be faster. Brian, that's fine. See, the unfortunate thing is, Hugs is physical attack. Not the greatest. She's a tanky girl. She is a tanky girl. Oh fuck, this thing has poison point. Huh. So that's a thing I need to be aware of when it comes to the Kinga. It could have poison point. That's not fun. Turn around. Damn it! <laughs> Turn that wrong. I've been training hard with Claire. There's no way I can lose. Alright, Hugs, just need to kill you. Just need you to kill this thing quickly. That's all you need to do. Bollocks! Alright. Alright. I've had enough. I've had enough of these goddamn fucking Seedras. Just because you evolve into a dragon doesn't make you an actual dragon. You're just a seahorse. And just like any seahorse, if you punch it hard enough, it will die. Case in point. Just punches through it. Suck it, Fran. Sucks about your Seedra. Yeah, we can't we can't go into the fight with Claire with 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 hugs poisoned. We can't can't do it. Can't do it. Not worth not worth risk. Not worth the risk. I don't think any of her Pokemon will have poison. What does she actually have? She has two Dragonair. Two Dragonair, Kingdra. And that's it? Because she doesn't have Dragonite. And she doesn't have Dratini. I'm fairly certain it's... I think in the rematches, she had... One of her Dragonairs has evolved into Dragonite. But the king is still more powerful. I think. I mean, I know that's the case with Lance. Where... Fuck's sake. Where... One of his, what, two Dragoners or whatever? Becomes a... Uh, a fourth Dragonite. Because, you know, given fucking three Dragonites. Oh no! No, he has two Dragonites in the first fight, doesn't he? They're very slowly getting up in levels, but that's still no thing compared to, uh, to Hugs. I'm 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 certain that her that she only has three. Am I certain? Not really. <laughs>
Ah. There she is. She leads with a Dragonair. We can kill the Dragonairs. I am Claire. The world's best dragon type master. Bullshit! I can hold my own against even the Pokemon League's Elite Four. Do you still want to take me on? Fine. Let's do this. As a gym leader, I will use my full power against my any opponent. <sighs> Let's go. Oh, she, has, she does have four. Oh, shit. I forgot about the Gyarados. Okay. I forgot she had you. I thought she led with a dragon there. I completely forgot about the Gyarados. It's fine, blah, 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 blah. can definitely tank a uh, dragon rage or two. Thunder Punch! Oh, that's a lot of health this thing has. But it's dead. Bring out the Kingdra. Come on, bring out the Kingdra. Let's see that Kingdra. Let's see that Kingdra. No, that's a Dragonair. That's fine. Hugs your back out. Tank it. Yeah, hugs. And hugs is faster than it because she's 14 fucking levels higher than the fucking thing. Yes. Fuck you, Dragonair. I might have I might have gone a bit OTT with the grinding. But I need to because of... I was expecting the Kingdra. That's fine, I'll kill your other Dragonair. That's fine with me. You want me to murder your Dragonairs? I'll murder your fucking Dragonairs. That's fine. Oh, you've got this. We've got this in the bag. Hey, buddy, leveled up. And there it is. It's only level four. I thought it was level 45. Bulbapedia lied to me. <laughs> Is it level 45 in rematches? Because I swear Bulbapedia said it was level 45. He <laughs> murder it. As long as she doesn't open with hyper beam. That's not hyper beam. Hyper beam was what you needed, and you didn't do it. Thunder punch. Punch it to death. Oh no. Oh, it's a tanky boy. Wait, is... It's... Oh, fuck. Dragon cancels out lightning. Does Electric, doesn't it? Oh, that's an oversight. Ah, fuck you. <laughs> Thunder punch. She didn't heal. She didn't use the potion. Oh, that was easy. That was a f that was a hell of a lot easier than I expected it to be. Huh? I lost. I don't believe it. There must be some mistake. I was not expecting it to be that easy. I mean, for one, I was expecting it to be you know a level forty-five kingdom, not a level forty-one. I'm very confused now. I won't concede this. I might have lost, but you're still not ready for the Pokemon League. Bitch, fuck you! I wiped you! Uh, I completely trounced your team. Fuck you! I know. You should take... I know, you should take the Dragon Master Challenge. Pinus Gym is a place called the Dragon's Den. 
and there's a small shrine at his heart. Go there. If you can prove that you've lost your lazy ideals, I will admit you are a trainer worthy of a gym badge. Bitch, go fuck yourself. You don't. You don't fire again, do you? No. So fuck off, mum. You definitely don't fight him again, right? I'm not I'm not misremembering it and managing to confuse myself right now. You don't fight him again, no. No, you don't. You don't fight him again until after the eight four when you have optional rematches with all the gym leaders. Which by the way, I am doing because that's how I'm planning on grinding for uh, the fight with Red. My plan for grinding when it comes to getting ready to fight Red is gym leader rematches and the Elite Four. <laughs> Just redoing the Elite Four over and over and over again. That's how I did it when I first played these games. <laughs> that's how I'll do it this time. Alright, let's switch out so Phil's in front. So that that way, we can actually capture something in this place. Because we can. Where you at, wild Pokemon? Where you at, not Dratini? You, how dare you enter uninvited? I, I didn't. Claire told me to come here because I kicked her ass, but she's a little bitch. Also, my dragon's bigger than your dragon. Fuck you. Bye-bye. Peace out. Ah. Oh, yeah. That. Oh, you bastard! Oh, fuck! Oh, Phil! Oh, Phil! Phil, 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 Phil! Oh, fuck! <laughs> no. <laughs> Fucking hell. That was, uh, well, that was fucking terrifying. Oh, boy. Wait. Swap, 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 swap. Why must you torment me? I will catch one. I will catch a Ralts. Basil will live again. I will catch a Ralts and name him Basil too. Stop tormenting me! I like how they consider Ralts to be... Uh, um, What the fuck does that do? Oh! 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 Okay. So that's what motor drive does. I 
I, uh... I would just like to personally apologize to Phil uh, for almost getting him killed. He is too good a boy to, to, to die like that to, to such a pathetic Pokemon. Uh, well, Fuse, I should probably give everyone items at some point as well, like never melt. Why the fuck haven't I done that? I have never melt ice on me, don't I? Uh, should do. I have an ice school blade which does exactly the same fucking thing. God damn it. Hugs take the ice school blade. Um, sea incense can be given to Benay. Have I got anything that? I don't have anything that increases the power of fire type moves, do I? This one I did. Uh, well, Bite's currently got the uh, XP shell on him. I'm pretty sure I can. I'm pretty sure I can get those at some. Well, obviously I can. I just don't know where. Why must you torment me so? Fuck you, game. <laughs> Moving swiftly on. Okay. Now we put Phil in front. The reason, the reason why Phil is going in front is simple. Dragon Rage. Can't catch it. Already caught it. Already killed it. I think. Can, however, burn this one. I don't know. It doesn't really scream Dragon's Den, does it? Like, yes, welcome to the pen welcome to the final stop before heading to the Elite Four and Victory Road. Your Pokemon for this place, Weedle. Is this what they replaced the Dratinis with? What do you? What is normally the most common thing you find in this place? Is it Dratini? I don't think it is. It might be Magikarp. It's probably magic up. Because obviously, you know, 
Gyarados. Fuck it, I'm going to fish. Have I not caught a sand trap before? I could have sworn I had. I mean, it's a Pokemon. Dargan. Her name is Dargan. I was double checking just to make sure I hadn't got um, the evolved form of Centra, which I don't remember. But nope, evidently not. Well, since um, since Victory Road is technically part of Kanto, that is the final Pokemon we will catch in. <laughs> oh wait, no, Well Islands. We still have the Well Islands to do, which is weird because I swear we should have done this by now. I swear we should have done the Well Islands by now. But, mm -hmm. So that's Dragon's Den done. Fuck me. <laughs> Let's go. Still, we have, like, the, the team is solid, like, we don't really need anything else. Right. I mean, when it comes to will, I have access to ghost type moves. The only real issue with it is that Dumbledore is the one with it, which is Shadow Ball. The only thing I'm really concerned about is Karen, because. Dumbledore could maybe take on a uh, will. Um, Hugs will be the one to take down uh, Lance, most likely, provided nothing unforeseen happens. Maybe use Phil to take down Karen? Like, make use of the other types on her Pokemon? I don't even remember what the fuck her, she has. If I'm being completely honest. Hmm. 
Like, what the hell is it that Karen has? Because I do not remember. Um, I'm actually just gonna lower the screen of my fan. It's a bit too much. Um. Let me think, what else? I mean, Dumbledore, between Dumbledore and Benet, Bruno and Koga will be taken care of. <coughs> and that just really leaves um, uh, Claire, not Claire, Karen. I don't know. I don't know. Dark is weird. Let me actually, just very quickly, I'll just look up Houndour, because Houndour is the first dark type Pokemon I always think of, because Houndour is my favorite dark type. Um, they're weak to fight in. They're weak to bug. Fairy, we don't have any. I mean. It's a risky one, but blah 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 does have low kick. We do have access to fighting type moves through blah 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 and um Ah oh, of course Part fire type Well I mean that's going on the assumption that she does have you know hound doom which I'm pretty sure she does I, I do not remember her her team at all like that's the problem po Gen um, these like Soul Silver and Heart Gold are my favorite Pokemon games they're the ones I've played the most out of any Pokemon game I do not, for the life of me, remember the original teams of the Elite Four. For the simple reason being, I've only fought the the original standard version of the Elite Four for Johto, at least in this version of Johto, once. And that was back when the game first came out. I wonder, I wonder if my old save is on, is still on my cartridge. It probably is. I could actually go check. Anything more annoying? Is there anything more annoying than that? Then you're leveling up when you're getting the XP, and stuff's just shy of that of that point. So annoying! So annoying! 
Uh, these are two Dratinis, aren't they? Yeah. I remember you two. Oh, Blizzard doesn't affect my t my partner Pokemon in uh, joint battles. Oh, that's nice. Figured it would. One Dratini dead. Two Dratini dead. Yep, two Dratini dead. <laughs> Woo! Hey, I got him up. Number 53. <laughs> oh, God. Again, I want to stress, I'm fairly certain Lance is highest level Dragonite. What the fuck is this doing here? Um, I'm fairly certain Lance is highest level Dragonite, level 50. Uh, I have antidotes on me, don't I? Should do. I have one. Thought I had more. Oh well. Could I not just... Could I not have just used the back door? This is just annoying. Oh my god. Stop with the goddamn swimming reedles. Why are they here? Eat the Weedle. Um, bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Again, eat the Weedle. I'm surprised it allows Safari Balls in the randomizer. In we go. Hello. Mm, good to see you here. No need to explain why you came. Claire sent you here, didn't she? That girl is a handful. I'm sorry, but I must test you. Not to worry, you'll only need to answer only a few questions. Ready? What are Pokemon to you? Friend. Oh, I understand. What helps you to win battle? Training. Oh, I understand. What kind of trainer do you wish to battle? Anyone. I'll fight you, old man. Oh, I understand. What is most important to about raising Pokemon? Knowledge, I, I guess. Oh, I understand. <laughs> Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon, which is more important? Both. I see you care deeply for Pokemon. Very commendable. That conviction is what is important. Blacks don't lose that belief. It was you who at the Pokemon League. Stop. So how'd it go? I guess there's no point in asking. You did fail. What? You passed? That can't be! You're, you're lying. Even I haven't been approved. Claire. 
This child is impeccable in skill and spirit. Admit defeat and confer the rising badge, you fucking bitch. Why must I inform Lance of this? I, I understand. Here, take this rising badge. Hurry up, take it. We'll do gladly. And with that, we have all eight. Woo! The rising badge will enable your Pokemon to use the move for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokemon will know you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. Claire, reflect upon what it is that you lack and this child has. By the way, have you heard of Lugia? Uh, between Old Vine and Seattle are islands called the Whirl Islands. There is a huge waterfall deep in the cave there. It is said that Lugia rests in the deep end of the waterfall basin. You need a silver ring to reach the waterfall basin, I've heard. Hmm. I wonder what it is I'm meant to do next. Maybe I should go in search of Lugia. Maybe I should go to the Wild Islands and try to capture myself Lugia. I will go to the Wild Islands and try to capture myself a Lugia. If it even is still a Lugia. Which it probably won't be. You never know, it might be ho ho. <laughs> I will be deeply disappointed if the randomizers replaced Lugia with a ho ho. I'm not gonna lie, I'll probably be disappointed if the if the randomizers replace Lugia with anything else. Because it's not guaranteed it has. It's just, you know, highly likely it's replaced Lugia with something else. All I know is, it's going to be a legendary way for me to hide that waterfall. That's all I know. I don't know anything else. I don't know what legendary it will be. All I know is, it will be a legendary. Cannot tell anything more than that. Do I have an escape rope? No. <sighs> what level's Lugia? I don't know. I genuinely don't know. Level 45. Well. Okay. I need to decide what my strategy is for Lugia. Well, I mean, I but I don't know. I I could strategize as much as I want, but when I get there, it could be a fucking Arceus. Or it could be a fucking Manaphy. I don't know. I assume it won't have I assume the randomizer won't have replaced Lugia with Manaphy. What do you want? Wait. I'm sorry about this. Here, take this as my apology. TM59. That contains Dragon Pulse. Well, Dragon Pulse is kind of a... Uh, uh, never mind. It's huge energy of some kind. If you don't want it, you don't have to take it. 
What's the matter? You are headed to the Pokemon League. Go back to New Bark Town and surf along Route 27. Your face is telling me you have some unfinished business. Come on. Whatever you have to face from now, don't you dare give up. If you do, I'll feel even worse about having lost to you. Give it your all. Let's go! Let's go! Hello, Blacks. How's it going? I've gotten hold of something neat. Swing by my lab and pick it up. See you later. It's time to fly. Let's go home. I do actually have a catch opportunity here. Because I was looking... I was looking through... Um... I never actually caught something in New Bark Town. Blacks, where are you going? Professor Alma has been waiting for you. He said he has something to give you. But I just want a fish. Mom, fuck off! I want a fish! First you take my money and now you won't let me fish! Fuck off, Mum! Blax, did you already collect eight badges? That's so cool. The professor is waiting for you. Hi, Blax. You never cease to amaze me. Thanks to you, my research is going great. Take this as a token of my appreciation. And we get the Master Ball. Depending on what it is, depending on what Lugia has become, I might just chuck the Master Ball at it. The Master Ball is the best. It's the ultimate Pokeball that will catch any Pokemon without fail. It's given only to noted Pokemon researchers. I think I, you can make much better use of it than I can, Blacks. It's also apparently given to people who win the fucking lottery as well. By the way, we just had a c c group of beautiful Camino girls looking for you. Blacks, people are talking about you. I heard you hug Camino girls. You've been helping all these people. You make me proud to be your friend. Okie dokie. The Camino girls are waiting for you at the Ikiti Dance Theater. What the fuck happened to the third Pokemon? Who took the Wurmple? Who took the Wurmple? <laughs> that's, that's my only question. I want to know who took the Wurmple. Lyra, did you take the Wurmple? Not going anywhere. I just want to fish. Why? Fine. I will go to Ecutique City. I just wanted to fish, but fine. What the fuck ever. Unless I killed the thing, I... Unless I killed my fish opportunity. How? How is this possible? How can I lose to... Mere Camino Girls? Kimono Girls? Why am I calling them Camino Girls? Those are those tall alien things. You were watching me, Blacks? Yeah, that's, that's right. I never thought the theme five Kimono Girls would be so hard. I got beaten to a pulp. Dot, dot, dot. You must have come here for the same reason, right? Well, don't get cocky just because you defeated Team Rocket. Those Kimono girls are extremely strong. Go ahead, see if you can defeat them. But I'm not going back. I don't want to see you win. Bye, Edgy the Hedgy. Hello. Welcome, my name is Zuki. I met you previously in Violet City. In order to bring back Lugia, we needed someone with the right bond with Pokemon. We asked Mix the Pokemon to give this mystery egg to whoever showed true potential. 
The egg was eventually handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm and then to you. However, being pure alone will not be sufficient to face the power of this Pokemon. I must test you. Are you ready? Yes. Also, we still have the egg. Because that's where we got Bidey from. I will test how closely you've bonded with your Pokemon. Bring it! Umbreon. Ah, oh, bless it! It's only level 38. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, bless. Eat it. Oh, damn. It done lived. Ow. Last one down. Evolution number one has been killed. Number two. You are quite strong. You helped me in the Elex Forest. My name is... Naoko. I am the one that's not so good at directions. My eyes witnessed to you defeating Team Rocket when Kurt was in trouble at the Slowpoke well. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Which one are you? Are you Espeon? Yes, you are. Hi, Espeon. Uh... You're the problem child. <laughs> Actually, no, you're not. I have a dark type move. Nom nom nom. That is a very dead espion. Anyway, moving on. Oh, you are truly strong. You fucking murdered my Pokemon. Jesus. Next. You are quite the trainer. I remember you chasing off that Team Rocket grunt from right here. I must thank you for that. Although I am actually a trainer myself. She who knows the most speaks the least. I am Miki, the Kimono Girl. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Question. Why didn't you fight him? I want to point out, this bitch is walking around with fucking level 8 Flareon. That Team Rocket going down like a level 12 Zubat. Explain. Explain your logic. And don't try and tell me, oh, we, we cannot fight within this, uh, within these hallowed halls. What the fuck do you think we're doing right now? This thing has fucking fire blast? Oh, no. Jesus. Yeah, drown the fucking thing. If you would, Binet. You bastard. <laughs> Pee on it. There we go. Hey, bye, levels up. Ooh, Leaf Storm. Leaf Storm is basically the grass equivalent. Yeah, it is. It is just the grass equivalent of uh, Fire Blast. Sleep powder is useful. We can. I. Mm. We don't really need extra sensory because if we're going to use psychic type moves, we can use Dumbledore. I'm also just going to close my windows real quick just so that. I don't get eaten. Because otherwise this room is going to be filled with bugs within a few minutes and uh, we'll be in I am a fan, I don't need windows open. Oh wait, what? Must be a learn now? Oh, Leaf Blade. 
Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get rid of Vine Whip and get Leaf Blade instead. God damn, when Victory Bow gets to level 47, Jesus. Hello. You got me off the ice by pushing me from the back. I am the one who skates in sandals. I am Seo, the, kim the kimono girl. I was listening to the dragon's den when you passed the test of the elder. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. So this is Vaporeon, right? Oh no, that's a Jolteon. How am I gonna deal with this one? You're all the problem child. Oh wait, no you're not. You're not a problem child at all. I had this big boy. I think I'm right in doing this. I see what the strategy is that she uses. Ow. Oh. Fuck. Right, fuck it. Send in Dumbledore. He may be the weakest of the team. But he's still more powerful than this. Psychic. Come on. He's also surprisingly quicker than it as well. Ah, fuck you. Oh, Dumbledore, come on! Yes! <laughs> come on, please hit. Ah, fucking... <sighs> don't crit, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Oh, boy. There we go. That'll kill it. And that just leaves the Vaporeon, which is fucked. <laughs> There's no other word for it. Oh, so close. I almost had you. Yeah, sure you did, though. <laughs> I am the last one. You were so dependable at the Golden Rod Tunnel. I am the one who twirls, even underground. I am Kune, the goal. I looked at you in wonder when you thwarted Team Rocket's mission to take over the radio tower. You must show your strength to me now. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. With my single Vaporeon. Vaporeon is so cute. Georgion's better, but still. Kill it. Mind Crusher, hello, long time. I am doing very well. I'm doing very well. I was until that crit happened. Jeez. 
But yeah, I'm doing, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. How are you yourself? How are you yourself? Are you well? Thunder Punch. Oh, after all that, blah, 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 faster. This should kill. Yeah, bye-bye, Vaporeon. I'm doing good, buddy. Good to hear. Good to hear. Very, very, very good to hear. We are not wrong about you. You are indeed worthy of this. Please take it. Get the title bell. Big sisters, I just saw the big shadow of a Pokemon in the Wild Island's waters. It could be. Blax, we will be at the Wild Islands. See you there. Okay. Fuck off, mum. So let's, uh, let's. This is rest up. Let's just rest up, shall we? <laughs> I think we should. <laughs> oh boy, I think we should. Ninja Layla, hello, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for the follow as well, by the way. Right. I greatly appreciate that. I greatly appreciate the follow. You were sneaky. You were very sneaky. Honestly, I didn't even notice until like 10 minutes into the stream. The only reason I noticed was because of the little uh, thing at the bottom corner. The one that is currently being moved. You are definite ninja. Definite ninja. Right. What is the best way to get into World Islands? So approach it from the bottom, right? Now, now, we have, how many repels do I have in my bag? How many max repels do I have? I want to say I have 10. Oh no, I have 13 of them. I can afford more. All right. This is, this is a uh, Pokemon for, what the hell? Go away, Discord. Oh, you don't sell them. That is point of view. Okay. Let's go get ourselves a legendary Pokemon. No idea what it might be. Absolutely no idea. Never played Pokemon, so I have no idea what you are doing. So, uh, this is a Nuzlocke run. Uh, the way a Nuzlocke run works is when you... Uh, you can only catch the first Pokemon you encounter on a route. Uh, and if a song is you haven't caught it before, which is an optional rule, which I use, just because it means have to use more interesting Pokemon. Um... And also you don't just end up with the same Pokemon being caught over and over and over again. And also, if a Pokemon faints, it is permanently boxed and can no longer be used. In addition, you have to nickname every single Pokemon because why not? Hence why there's a channel point reward for you guys being able to nickname uh, Pokemons. That we catch on a first come first serve basis, basically. So the first name that gets suggested will be the next one we use, and so on and so forth. So I actually want to not encounter something in here because the bottom of this dungeon is usually Lugia, who is my favorite legendary Pokemon. However, this is a randomizer. Run. I don't know what the fuck is in this dungeon. All I know is at the bottom of this uh, dungeon, 
There is a legendary Pokemon. There is a level 50 legendary waiting for me at the bottom of this dungeon. I don't know what it is. All I know is that it is a legendary Pokemon. Why can't I use strength? I have strength, but Ney has it. Sandy has strength. I don't really want to have to go get her back. Get out the box. So, so it. Also, I'm fairly certain I need to use Rock Smash to get through this place as well. Benet is just becoming the HM slave at this at this point, isn't he? Strength has power of eighty. Yeah, it's not that much worse than body slam. I would like to use strength, yes. I have absolutely no idea what is waiting for me at the bottom of this dungeon. I'm really, really, really worried there's going to be something really shit. But I mean, during the Fire Red playthrough, the randomizer actually replaced the... Um, the two legendary one, the two legendaries they actually bothered to go do, with actually something somewhat decent. Oh, shit! Let's uh, let's put another repel in there. Or anyone asks, no, I am not looking up the uh, the map of the of the World Islands. No, not at all. It's, uh, it's it's totally not that the that Flash is a fucking stupid ass dungeon gimmick. It should not be a thing at all. Okay. Okay, well, I see where I am. So I'm not there. Nope, I'm totally not just now just using a map. Seriously, fuck Flash. Let's be honest, there's a reason why Flash was the first HM to, dr to go. Because nobody likes this. Uh, uh, okay, so what are those things under your cam frame? It looks like bandages. Yes, yes, they are. So they are base. So basically, uh, these are the bosses. Basically, the gym leaders. Uh, and after you defeat each one, they give you a a badge. So this is basically just a way of tracking progress. Uh, each Pokemon game has eight gyms, uh, so eight badges, and then you go fight the Elite Four, which are the end, which are the final bosses. 
uh, and the champion. However, this generation is different because what they did for Gen 2 was after you beat the uh, Elite Four, you, ins you then um, went back to Kanto, which is the setting for uh, Gen 1, and do all those gym leaders, and then you fight them, and then you fight your player character from Gen 1. Spoilers. Um, so we have done all of uh, Johto. We just did the 8th Johto gym. Uh, so we are just doing this last little story event, which is basically go catch the mascot Pokemon. And then we are off to the Elite Four to do all of that. And then we're off to Kanto. So, whoa! <laughs> we're actually getting... We're almost halfway through. We get, well, not really halfway. We're about two-thirds of the way through. Um... So if I open back up my map, <laughs> because fuck it. Um, so we're at we've just gone down ladder E. Take me up to F. Don't really want. So how the fuck do you? What ladder do I want? I want that one. Right. So how is that I'm meant to get to it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know! Fuck this puzzle. <laughs> right, I now cannot see chat because I just have the map open. I'm just looking at a map of this dungeon because fuck this shit. This is a weak clump. Weak clumpy bit. If I keep going. Okay, so I'm there. Okay, so I want to go... Well, that can't be right. An armor fossil. God damn, I'm getting... I'm going to have... Fucking free pick when we get to pewter. I'm just gonna be able to pick what uh, fossil Pokemon I get from uh, pewter city. I'm pretty sure it's pewter city where you get the fossil Pokemon in this one. Right, so that brings us back out. And then we need to go... Ah, shit. So...
I'm gonna try to puzzle this out. So. Well, I want to get to that ladder there. I want to get to ladder B. I just don't see an obvious way of doing it. Basically, what I need to do is I need to get to the center. That bit I was just what, running around in, I need to get to the center of that. Oh, we just lost repel. That's fine. We can wait until we're actually back in before we reuse repel because we don't need to worry about this route anyway. Um, Okay, I, I, I did the wrong thing. I did the wrong way of doing it. Apparently. Apparently. I did the wrong way. So... If I do this... Fast travel back to the north side. Because I need to be in the northeast island. So basically, I'm just looking at it wrong. And it is as simple as I thought it looked originally. Also, uh, Ninja Layla, if you don't mind me asking, how have you not played Pokemon? Like, how have you gone your whole life without playing Pokemon? And yet still be into RPGs? I don't, I don't fully understand. If you turn around and say, never owned a Nintendo console, I will understand, mostly. Um... <laughs> God, I, I want Kranidos. I want a Kranidos. Um, my mum wasn't a fan of me watching it on TV, so I didn't get into it. Oh, okay. Okay, I get you. I get you. Yeah, yeah, I know a few people, I know a few people like that, where this is over, just like, they just 
thought it was weird or or their parents just were just like oh Satan Pikachu is Satan I, I genuinely know people whose parents thought that I'm not saying yours did I'm just saying I know people whose parents were like that which only funnily enough much like with D&D &D back in the 80s just drove people to it anyway because hey it may not be great publicity for Pokemon but it was publicity uh, I mean manga was still a new thing I turned out a weeb though I love anime oh me too me too like I owe my love of uh, anime to Admittedly, mostly Yu-Gi-Oh! I never really, like, I was into the Pokemon anime when I was a kid. My sister was much more into the Pokemon anime. I was much more into the games and the training card game. Um, as you can tell, we were kind of fans back in the day. Like, those are originals. All the Pokemon stuff I have on display is originals from the 90s. Like, we were, me and my sister were big into Pokemon. Not as much nowadays. My sister is like she'll she'll still like play like Gen One and Gen Two and what have you. But I'm very much into Mad Pokemon's still. I don't really like any of the new games. Uh, if you don't mind me asking, how old are you? I am 26. I am 26. My, uh, uh, my sister is 27. No, 28. Yeah, she's 29 this year. Fuck. So, both me and her were the prime age for it. Like, we were... Like, I was... Like, six? When we got Pokemon over here, my sister would have been, like... Ten, like, eight? Eight, nine, ten-ish? So, we were... Like, right at that age. Um, the, uh, Pokemon Crystal was the first video game I ever owned. Because my first console was Game Boy Color, which came with a copy of Pokemon. Fuck, that made me jump. <laughs> that made me jump. I was not expecting that. I blinked. Fucking sound alerts. <laughs> it's not even a jump scare sound alert. I just wasn't expecting it. Hello. A thing you have. Look, it's a it's a wing. It's a feather. You have found it. Please go ahead. Yes, I have Lugia's tail feather or whatever the fuck this is. He's in that. How are you? Did I scare you? Are you did? You did. Thank you very much for the host, Blake. Thank you very, very, very much for the host. How are you, my friend? How are you? I was just uh, saying about how uh, Pokemon Crystal was my first ever video game and how I was prime age demographic for Pokemon back in the 90s. Uh, I got to meet an actor from a TV show I used to watch as a kid. Ooh! Ooh, do tell. That's right. This is where we welcome Lugia. When the dance we practice many days becomes one with the sound of the tidal bell we entrusted with you, then Lugia shall come out from deep within the waterfall basin once again. Oh. Oh. And now we get to watch Pretty Dance. And listen to really fucking nice music. While well, apparently the fucking ocean seeps in and we drown. Is the Lugia randomized? The Lugia is randomized. All I know is that it's a legendary. That's all I know. It's, it's a legendary Pokemon that has to be at similar power level to a level 50 Lugia. So it could be fucking anything except like a Manaphy or one of the Lake Trio. 
Can I be the encounter? Are you a legendary Pokemon? <laughs> oh, here we go. The ominous music has started. At least we get to see Lugia. Ah, oh, he's so pretty! I love Lugia. Lugia is best legendary. Look how pretty he is! He's such an angry boy. That is indeed Lugia, the guardian of these islands from ancient times. So many have tried again and again only to fail. Blacks, your heart, in complete harmony with the tidal bell, has finally allowed it to appear. Blacks, don't you see? Lugia, it must have been waiting for someone like you all this time. Wouldn't you agree? Yes. This is all we can do for you. What you do now is entirely up to you. Well, we're not killing it. This is our encounter for this place. We're catching it. We have to. As is tradition, <laughs> we must save. We either catch it, or this entire place has been a waste of time. He also has a, has a um, loose pixel on his eye. I've never noticed that before. I don't know if that's a thing on the DS or if that's just the emerald. There we go, I fixed it. <laughs> right. Now, I have a plan which can backfire immensely depending on what legendary this thing is. My plan is simple. Dragon Rage. Dragon Rage to weaken it and then maybe put it to sleep. And then if all else fails, chuck the Master Ball at it. I'd rather not use the Master Ball, though, because I'd rather save the Master Ball for the ho -Oh. Here we go. Hey, we're about to effect draw off. Oh, I fuck for that. We can encamp... Wait, what the fuck was that cry? Is it Deoxys? That's not a fucking Deoxys! That's also not a fucking Lugia! Um... <laughs> um... So when I mentioned earlier in the stream, I wonder if it's an Arceus. So for those who don't know the lore of Pokémon, uh, this is God. Just straight up, this is the thing that created the Pokemon you the Pokemon world. This is God in Pokemon. <laughs> Let's fucking go <laughs> Dragon Rage. Let's see how it do. <laughs> Fuck you. Phil the Mighty will not be crushed by you. Uh oh. Now it can. Oh, you cheeky fuck. You cheeky little shit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's its big thing. Ooh. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy, boy, boy. Um, also, there is the uh, slight issue of the fact that this thing is... Because this thing is God, um, it has quite a low catch rate. So, um... Hmm. If it uses Earth Power, it'll probably kill.
I have no one who can really survive an Earth power. Except maybe Hugs. Hugs probably could. So we know it has gravity. So things it's used so far are Earth power, gravity, and uh, hyper voice. Don't know the fourth. And the thing is, this this fucking thing can learn any move. There is not a single move in in the entire game this thing doesn't know. Outside of, I think maybe like, ex like legendary exclusive moves like Roar. Actually, no, I think it can use Roar of Time and shit like that. Pokeball, go! Cap the center of the Pokeball on the bottom screen! Believe! No! Ha! Ah, fuck you! Fuck it, Master Ball it is. Do I want to try and put it to sleep? Nah, nah. I think... I think catching an Arceus is a pretty fair thing to use the Master Ball on. Go, Master Ball! We've got it. Fuck you, God! We tried to catch it legitimately, but fuck it. I ain't risking it. I, I want God in my Poke in my team. Fuck it, why not? According to the Legends of Sinnoh, this Pokemon emerged from an egg and shaped all there is in this world. Again. God. <laughs> um, give a nickname to Cord Arceus. Yes. His name is Tiddles. <laughs> Where will Tiddlywinks think? Tiddlywinks will just fit. Yes. Tiddlywinks. Okay, Tiddlywink, fine. Tiddlywink is a perfectly fine name for God. There we go. His name is Tiddlywink. Beautiful. That's, yep. That's a... That's a bit of a step up from... Oh yeah, it's a giant fuck off whale. <laughs> like it's a it's a big ass whale based off of the Leviathan from Greek mythology. To because that's what Lugia is. Because uh, the legends of uh, the legends of Johto are based off of well, very very much inspired by Greek mythology. Because the two main legendaries of Johto, Lugia and um, Lugia and Ho -Oh are both things from it, because Lugia is the Leviathan and Ho -Oh is the Phoenix. I also don't have an escape rope, do I? What do you want, man? Hello, oh hi Blax, how are you? I found a use- Oh yeah, she bought something with my money. Bitch. Right, um... Oh wow. <laughs> Good lord, I'm happy I used a repel. I'm very happy I used a repel. We could have caught a love disc. <laughs> and we not bothered? We could have been taking home a love disc instead. We're taking home God. Which begs the question: What the fuck is Ho? -Oh? Because <laughs> just because this is Soul Silver, I can still go and catch Ho. -Oh. I'm pretty sure you actually get a second attempt to catch Lugia if you don't catch him. 
If you don't catch Lugia in this encounter, I'm fairly certain after you do the Elite Four, you have a second opportunity to catch it if you come back to the Wild Islands. I don't know, I've always managed to catch him in that encounter. Um... But, if, uh, but once you do the Elite Four, if you go to the Bell Tower in Soul Silver, Wild Islands, and Heart Gold, you can catch the other legendary. Hence how I have both. Hence why I have them both in my actual physical copy from way back in the day. Uh, right. Uh, I guess we'll. But we'll head to buy. The, we'll head to Cherry Grove City first. Um. I think what we'll do is we'll get to Victory Road and then finish up the stream for the day. Because I don't feel particularly confident going through Victory Road right now. I'd rather grind a little bit. Also, it gives us an opportunity to, take, to check out uh, the stats of Tiddlywinks. Let's check Tiddlywink. Tiddlywink. Extreme speed was the other move. Jesus. Um, okay. I mean, I can replace extreme speed with fucking anything, so. I'm going to be honest, I don't really want Tiddlywink in the party. Like... It's cool having him. It's very cool having him. Oh, I need to cross off the uh, World Islands from my list. Uh, Root Tracker. World Islands has been caught. Woo! Uh, so... What we now want to do is head back to New Bark Town. Uh, we then want to go from New Bark and just go ahead and surf on over. And make our way to... Well, we have two catch opportunities left before the Elite Four. We have this route that we're about to go on, I think. I think we only have two. Yeah, Route 20. I don't. F we shouldn't have caught anything on Route 27 yet. We shouldn't have been able to get on this route. Nope. So. We have this one. Is a mud cap. Yes, yes, we like the mud cap. We like the mud cap. Now, how the fuck am I gonna catch you without killing it? Um, Ultra Ball Go. <laughs> I guess. Hmm. Problem. A level 20 mudkip. Probably doesn't have more than 40 HP, so it'll probably die to Dragon Rage. We can throw Pidey out. Put it to sleep. Uh, 
Go sleep, little mudcap. Go sleep. Man. No! You cheeky little shit. I'm gonna risk it! Because I have no other real way of weakening it. Where it will likely survive. Please have more than 40. Please. Please have more than 40 HP. <gasps> it did! Yay. Oh god, I'm running very low on Ultra Balls. Oh shit. <gasps> <gasps> Huh? Hey! We've got a mud cap! We've got ourselves a mud cap! We got a mud 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 cap! Got a mud cap! We got a mud cap! We got a mud cap! His name will be. Now it is officially a Twitch playthrough of a Pokemon game. His name should be... Kipper. Does anybody else remember Kipper? That was a great show. The talking Kipper. Kipper the dog. You're taking your first step into Kanto. Check your Poké game app and see. Yeah, can do. Oh, we also have Tojo Falls as well. I forgot we had Tojo Falls beforehand. So that's Route 27 can be crossed off. We have, do not have many left. Wow, we do not have many left. The oranges, the orangish dog. Maybe. Hang on. Oh yeah, this is screen cap. So uh, these are the routes I left. <laughs> There's not many, as you can see. Um, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm looking this up. Yes, yes, he was orange. Yes, yes. Also, fuck you, Twitch. Fuck you, Twitch. Ah, oh, nostalgia! <gasps> I fucking loved this show as a kid. I love it. <laughs> Anywho, <laughs> back to Pokemon. <laughs> I don't know where the I don't know where the fuck that came from. <laughs> I just suddenly went into my brain. You know, you know when stuff from your childhood just randomly goes into your head. An apom. Could be worse, I suppose. You have to have more than 40 HP, surely. Right? Ha, ah, fuck you, this ain't team battle, you shit. Go, buddy. <gasps> Tickling? No! Uh, I barely remember. Jeez, we old. Yeah. 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 
When did Kitler come out? Hang on. Kipper. Kipper the dog. The TV series. Here we go. Oh, God. It came out in 1997. Oh, no. I don't like that. Don't like that. Started in 5th of September. The first episode was released on the 5th of September 1997. The last one was released on the 21st of December 2000. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Don't like. I don't approve. Kipper the dog is 15 years old. That dog is dead. And now I've made myself sad. <laughs> Wait, would he be 15? No, he'd be 14 years old, wouldn't he? Still probably be dead. That hurts. Yeah, it does. It does, don't it? Oh, oh no. <laughs> Get the monkey. No, he would be 23. Oh, shit. Yeah, he would be 23. Yeah. Yeah, that's a very dead dog. That's a very dead dog. Oh. <laughs> monkey. Welcome to the team, monkey. Monkey. I know how maps works. <laughs> yep. I I know maps. I know how to add. I'm trying to remember how I actually get to where I need to go. That's a Raiko. Oh wow, yeah, that is a while before I even get to Victory Road. This is a long ass route. Hmm. Okay. Change of plans. Change of plans, because it's almost 11 o'clock and I have work tomorrow. Uh, so, what we will do is we'll head back to Newbuck. Uh, what did I study in uni? I studied film. I studied film and creative writing. Which, I mean, I use the creative writing part of it with running D&D stuff. I guess I use the film degree side with all of this and the editing, uh, the videos. I wasn't expecting that. What were you expecting? <laughs> I studied science! I'm not sure to be honest. I almost went into history. Because I am big history nerd. Hence why my favorite RPG is Call of Cthulhu. Um, but yeah, we are going to finish up. Up here. Uh, because, like I said, I have work tomorrow. Uh, I was kind of planning to get the Victory Road Pokemon. But, nah. <laughs> we'll do that uh, Thursday. Thursday I'm actually scheduled to do this. So, um, Thursday we'll probably do Victory Road. Maybe. Hmm. We will see what happens during Victory Road, and then I will decide whether or not we do the Elite Four next, on on Thursday. Because we might. I 
don't know. It depends on the, on the situation coming out of Victory Road. But I'm going to be honest. I'm feeling good. I'm... F I'm... I've not really felt this good about this run since we had the the big fucking incident. Um, back when we lost everyone. But yeah, we pulled it back pretty bloody well. Thanks to you guys giving me permission to use every area of the Safari Zone instead of just one Pokemon from the Safari Zone. But yeah, uh, I thank you everybody for stopping on by. Thank you, uh, Blake for the host. Uh, thank you again, Ninja Layla for the uh, for the old follow. How close are we to two hundred now? We are on one hundred and eighty-three. God damn! God damn! That's a lot of you. Um. So we'll close Pokelink. We will stop that. And we will do a very quick save state. And we'll close out uh, the game. And we will see who's currently live. And who we can rate. Grimace is live. Grimace. I have not seen Grimace live for a while. He's currently playing some WoW. Is that like a new expansion for WoW coming out or something? That might be. I don't know. The only RPG, I, the only MMO I really play is uh, Final Fantasy XIV. So, so uh, speaking of which, I will be back on Thursday with more Pokemon. Uh, where, like I said, we'll do Victory Road. Maybe the Elite Four. I don't know, see how we feel. And then on Friday, Five Hazard 14, uh, with, as we continue to work our way through Realm Reborn and Heaven's Ward, and hopefully, hopefully soon, I'll uh, be able to upgrade to full account so we can get ready for Endwalker. Cause that shit will take fun. Uh, but yeah, uh, when I'm a software engineer, Ooh. Ooh, cool. <laughs> that's that's really, really, really cool. Honestly, that's really cool. Um I tried I tried getting into software engineering. Uh the closest I come is building PCs. Which the more I think about it, I don't think it's really the same thing, is it? But Oh well. Oh well. I tried coding. That's hardware. Yeah, I was gonna say. I did try coding back in the day. I tried coding some stuff. I tried to learn JavaScript. And after like a month of trying to self teach myself how to do Java, I was like, hmm. Alternatively, I can get other people to do it for me. So that's what I do. <laughs> Simple as that. I edit. I edit stuff. I taught myself how to use Premiere and stuff like that. But oh well, oh well. And uh, just for that little uh, self-congratulatory thing statement. That was for me. That was for me for teaching myself how to use Premiere. Yep. I deserve it. I deserve it. I will be uh, honestly looking for my sound alerts. I am scared about the day one of you fuckers finally redeems that copyright strike one. That 1000 bits one. Where it just plays the entire Pokemon theme tune. Like, there's not even anything else to it. It's just the entirety of the Pokemon theme tune. And I fear the day someone actually redeems that. Because I feel like it's gonna... Ha I, I mean, I'd quite like it to happen because obviously one, it's 1,000 bits. And two, fucking hell, that would be funny. <laughs> but 
but at the same time, no one fucking redeem that because again, it's a thousand bits for it. Please, nobody redeem that. Anywho, anywho, uh, let I will hand you guys on over to Grimace, who, like I said, is currently playing some WoW. Uh, I don't know what he's doing, but he's playing some WoW. He's playing some WoW. I know almost nothing about World of Warcraft. I haven't played World of Warcraft since. Cataclysm? I think was the last. No, I played a little bit of Warlords Adrenal, but not much. Uh, and I, I, I stopped playing WoW at the end of Cat, at the end of Cataclysm, because I didn't like the Kung Fu Panda bullshit. And now looking back, I was stupid. I played for two months, not my thing. 2021, still pixelated, no thank you. Yeah, also, Blizzard's really fucking pissed me off with the way they handled WoW Classic, with the fact you have to pay more to play the old school expansions, even if you already own them. And they've started, and they've started re-releasing the old uh, expansions and charging people for them. Like, they just re-released... Re They've just re-released Burning Crusade and are uh, fucking charging people for it. When there were servers that were offering it for free that they took down. Anywho, the raid's about to go through, so I will see you all on Thursday. Have a good night, have a good day, wherever you are, whatever the time is. And, uh, yeah. Goodbye!